Hey guys, this is Mini, and I just wanted to say before we start this video and get into this game, which is oddly named, <laughs> uh, this does tackle some serious topics, uh, one of them being, I think, either murder or suicide, so if you are sensitive to those topics, please feel free to click off. This also does get quite psychological and quite, like, thinking and make your brain rack, so there's that. Uh, uh, I know this due to playing the game before, uh, last night with my friends, uh, but I needed to record this to give this the attention it deserves, although I'm probably not going to do that, although I hope it does at least get out to a few people that might like this and might become a fan of it. Uh, the developer of this game also has a lot of other visual novels and psychological horrors and stuff like that to check out, so you might see more from this developer in the future on my YouTube channel. So, let's get into it. I'm on my way to the store, rehearsing the speech. Haven't been out for so long that I've forgotten what words they say when they enter the store. I'm on my way to the store. I imagine being a game character. What if it helps to gather my thoughts? What game? Well, you know. There are games in which you can see characters' thoughts right on the screen, you know? So I thought, if someone reads my thoughts, then I have to be really con concentrated so as not to whip up the extra. <laughs> I'm deeply breathing in. Hello, can I... Damn, I forgot. Also, you can scroll to go back up in the chat and back down. 19th attempt, and I'm failing again. I bite my lips with annoyance. So, once again. Hello, can I get... Wow, a whole word more. Word more. Thank you. I'm trying really hard. My opinion... This time the I should sound was longer than usual. Do you think this is it? Who knows? Hello, can I... Uh, I'd better keep my lips sealed. Don't worry. Okay. By the way, you've been walking with your left foot on asphalt and your right foot on grass for a whole minute. What? My right leg froze in the air. How much? 50 steps on asphalt and 50, 51 on grass. You'll have to cancel the previous step. Hehe. <laughs> How do you imagine it? This is not the first time. You were taught how to do it. Come on. I don't remember. I'm going to burst into tears. Uh, from the beginning. So, step one. Take a step back to get your foot exactly into your own trail. How is it step one? What then? So it's already the 52nd, but wait, I'm going backwards, then f 50th? It still doesn't make a lot of sense. Okay, okay. Step 15, uh, 50th. Take a step back to get your foot exactly in your trail. Could you paraphrase it at least a little? You can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. You're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. The store closes in an hour, so you'll be very, very guilty if you don't buy milk. Damn, really? So, are you ready? Yes, yes. I gently change the position of the leg, peering carefully into the thick grass. When I entered the store, I asked the very first person I met. Hello, can I? I love the design of this game, how it's all red scale, and, well, reds and pinks and that, because you wouldn't notice, but it, it, it sort of just looks like a girl with pigtails, but there's two sets of what appear to be eyes, and it, um, it makes you think that this person is seeing the, uh, seeing the world a bit differently to what, uh, Others may see it, and that's your first sign that something's up. Oh? 
Excuse me, what? Oh, 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 and this is where you start to realize that sometimes there's a, a, a loop that you can get into. And uh, it's sort of, um, sort of hinted at by the name of the game, which is Milk Inside of a Bag of Milk and Milk Inside of a Bag of Milk, I think, if I remembered that rightly. <laughs> You'd better not do it. He's clearly not going to change his lines. You run the risk of fa uh, falling into an endless loop. Excuse me, what? Oh. 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 What? Oh. What is he trying to tell you? He's trying to scare me, but how does he know that I'm terrified by the letter O? What is it? Okay, this is a surprising bit, so. It's weird. It's very weird, I'll tell you that. What is so terrible about it? I have a frightening image as soon as I imagine it. I can show. Explaining won't be enough, but keep in mind that... <laughs> Something like that. So I'll just keep on ignoring his question. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. I gather all the will into a fist. Oh? Oh. <laughs> My interlocutor shook and crawled. You just repeated after him, and it worked. Do it more often. Wait, I, it's, I said that he crawled, but did he? He really crawl? Because I didn't even look in this direction. And exactly did you say that? Yeah, just now. Personally, I, I didn't hear. You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. I'm standing by the shelves. On the shelves there are bags of milk. The two of us are standing and milk lies. Or maybe... Hey, hey, slow down. Do you remember? Do you even remember why you came here? To buy milk. So buy. Right here? How, in your opinion, should I reply? Hmm. I suppose, like, something like, not here. I'll... I haven't chosen this line, so I'll choose it. You're getting on my nerves. You don't want to help me at all, do you? I sigh and pull my hand to take milk, or rather, a bag of milk inside. Those are two lines, and then there's this one. I guess the first sentence. And you're like... Y and you like for spite. Like for spite don't, didn't make a pause before the second one. Want to take away all my small victories? I sigh and pull my hand to take, or rather, a bag of milk inside. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside. Reception, reception, 15 minutes before store closing, hurry up. I remember what these games are called, visual novels. And by the way, the numbers are written there in full, in letters, are visual novels worse than books? But our authors are not lazy, there are, uh, are not lazy there, and you don't be lazy too. Wait, I thought you only your thoughts were visible on the screen. Not anymore, so watch your language. <laughs> anyway, you heard me, hurry up or there will be no good at home. Already running. Hello, can I get milk, please? And then another weird character design. No, the weird, oh Jesus. The weirdest body, neck, misshapen head, misshapen arms. You have it. Ah, uh, give. I put on out a weighty bag at the pay desk. Of course, not just a bag, but a milk too. Hello, can I get it back, please? No, please, no. Please, mum will throw me out of the window if I get back without milk. No. But why not? Give more. But I don't have anything else. Hey. What? Pay for the milk. See, this is another nod to how the main character sees things very differently and works differently. Because to us, it would just be like, 
that will be X amount of whatever currency you use, or that'll be like one pound fifty for me. But for this character, it's just give more, give, and then they just thought they could place it down and take it away, and that's it. I pull a crumpled cash out of my pocket and give it to the cashier. He starts to carefully examine it. About two days have passed before he nodded satisfactorily and put a cash in the machine. And there's another line there. I, I really love this. How it just makes, although for us, it's like, it'd be so different. But this is just a sort of gateway into seeing how someone's brain might be affecting their situation differently. Thank you, goodbye. The music is also really like mood setting and although it's although it's a horror game, it isn't like scary scary, it's more of like unsettling in a way. I'm walking down a familiar street past a gas station. A bag of milk unpleasantly pulls away at my hand, reminding me of the times I took physical therapy. By the way, they gave me a bag at the pay machine, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk inside about another bag. Don't get me wrong, I just like the uh, pyramidal, uh, or pyramidal structure of a verbal constructions. The gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thanks for your interest. I feel like a mile of ice cream. What is that supposed to mean? As if I tell you, but I'm really interested. Well, look, the ratio of water to milk in the volume of air occupied by me is about 30 to 1. I agree it's not the tastiest ice cream unless you want to drink more than you eat. So, the way from the store to the gas station is a stick and the way from the gas station to home is ice cream. For today's walk, my body will be in every part of this way. Simple maths. Okay. Feel movement under my feet, asphalt, grains, petrol stains. I'm trying to keep my balance, and how do, peop and how do people move on something as uneven as the urban plain? Neat heel sock. I count every meter of the way I've gone. I even close my eyes for more concentration. Hey, watch out. Huh? I unconsciously take a sharp step aside. At the same moment, a huge bear sweeps past me with a wild ripple. Hey, I'm walking here. I'm throwing a stumbling peek at the rapidly moving animal. Its red eyes, in turn, look at me with mockery. Did you see that? How brazen. It was a truck. Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears with eyes on the back of their head? You might have died. Come on, are you saying someone will seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? The world is a cruel and dangerous. I'm not in the world you're talking about. <laughs> Another thing. Many people think this game nods at... Uh, schizophrenia or stuff like that too because of this and um, I thought this at first too but then more comes into play later on in the game which I've already discussed at the beginning <laughs> well I I've alluded to it you won't see the exact thing until I get there I'm not in the world you're talking about My path continues. If you think about it, the way from the store has one interesting property. In the most bizarre ways, it adjusts to me. When I hurry, all the traffic lights. When I hurry, all the traffic lights are servicefully extinguished. When I want to cry, a cloud appears and pours rain flows that hide my tears. Right now, I feel how the cloud is slowly gathering over my top. I'm sad. Are you sure all this is really happening? And how else? Have you been visited by the idea that all this is in your head? The instruction did not say that at all. Apparently these pills don't work on me either. Pills have nothing to do with it. Please, I just want to get home and go to bed. I'm really, really grateful to you, but please, no more. 
You know what? Okay, so I'm gonna go back and show you this. You must accept the truth. No. You must accept the truth. No. If you just keep doing it, that happens. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it does that, and then it, if if I don't catch it like that, it will close the game, <laughs> and I'll have to restart everything again. So, I also just wanted to quickly talk about that. That's um, that's another part where if you get in a loop with the main character and going against what they want or what the narrator wants, that they will forcibly break out of it and forcibly stop the game or for them their made up section so yeah I found that really cool and a really interesting touch anyway back to the video we go back here I'm really grateful to you but please no more and if you say silent it changes you know what what since I'm a character in a visual novel I want to talk whoever is reading this right now this can affect your recovery in a wrong way. I don't care, do you hear it? I squeeze my head with the, hand, with the hands and set a thought block. With the edge of my eye, I notice a small bench, a great place for cliched, cliched visual novel monologues. I'm getting closer, putting a noticeably heavy bag of milk nearby and raising my head to the sky. I'll discuss what this is when it comes up, by the way. Because, oh, listen, I'm a little embarrassed that I understand I'm going crazy. Drugs are working less and less effectively, so that means, like, rehabilitation drugs, not, you know, recreational or what illegal. Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you understand what I'm talking about? No. Well, I'm not very surprised. I must be quite unlike an exemplary protagonist, right? To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Sometimes I regret it because now I need a lot of effort just to distinguish letters and words. By the way, if you don't mind, I wouldn't like to say my diagnosis. Now, I'm going to discuss this section now. Uh, when it came to this point, me and two of my friends thought that this could be a something to do with a developer that they're trying to put across in a story, or someone they know they're trying to put across through a story. And um, it's a pretty cool way, really. I really like how they've d how they've done this. Let at least you be the one who sees me as I am. Even if I made you up, don't take it away from me, okay? Don't ask me about too much. How stupid is all this? From the very beginning you followed me, read my delusional thoughts, heard my stupid conversations. Maybe I seem crazy and weird to you. What is it like to see the world with my eyes? Ever since <clears throat> something happened, I only see red everywhere. No, don't worry about me. I've been used to it for a long time. To be honest, I even forgot what other colors look like. Let it go. <laughs> Those monsters from the store, they didn't scare me at all because I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think they're the ones who are scared. Can you imagine it? By the way, if you want to ask me what happened, please don't. Do you promise? Of course, you could not ask. In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I would have raised this topic. So you're really wondering what happened to me? I won't take time. What do you see? Are you sure? One way or another, this is my dad. Some of his parts, at least. Also, the only reason I knew to input that is because I played it before. 
Also, I'm pretty sure you can put in whatever and um, you get this, this same part. Also, I played, said this the first time I played through this and I said this oddly looks like a face. But I know it's not supposed to be now that I'm not looking through it at a stream, but instead just in front of me. Because that's more of an arm now that I see it. We do have a very difficult family, but despite all the problems, I would never have thought. Sorry, I shouldn't have raised my voice. In general, he threw himself out of the window and died. This is my last memory. Um, a long gap. So, I can't remember if this says this. I'll click a few forward and then I'll explain. Strange. Very strange. Today is the first time I've been able to buy something from a store without a serious incident. Of course the medicine helped me, however. Yeah, no, I don't think it addresses it. I just think of my friends and I spoke about this. So what we thought is this is either a looking into at a body and this is either looking top down at a grave without a coffin or it's looking through a small peephole at someone that's just seemingly surrounded by red and it's just a closed off person that's going through so much. I think it's more of your merit. I was thinking all the time, do not screw up in front of the reader, or oh my god, what will he think? <laughs> I don't know why I decided to become a character in a visual novel for the sake of going to the store today, but it is clearly born through fruit. Thank you. By the way, I think there are some frameworks in our communication. That's how I like it. Notice how as soon as he mentioned, or the developer, or the whoever this is, mentioned the framework, the menu and borders have gone. There's no longer any framework, because I'm not putting anything in, because no messages have come up here. And yet, I'm so sad lately. I think more and more about what my life has become ever since Dad. Well, you understand. Day after day is the same. I've tried so many pills that I can't feel difference between them anymore. As long as they keep me on my feet, I'm happy. <laughs> but you know what? Today is a special day because I have you. I want to tell you so much. I want to tell you so much you can't even imagine. It was very rude of you. Oh, no. Nah. I will not press you, I just advise you, go home. I understand. Back to the game character, because it's in quotes, it's got that voice sound effect. I love this game. Well, dear reader, let's go. I stop on my floor and hang by the railing. Repeating this action every day like a ritual, I stopped being afraid of heights. A few minutes ago, the pills finally came to naught, so I'm just enjoying blissful silence. When I am under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head. Mixing with the sounds of the world around me, they created a terrible dissonance in my head. So that framework was the pills. They allowed me, as the reader, to speak to the character, or the developer, or whoever's telling this story. The narrator. But, um, now I have no input, there is no music. And that's because the drugs, quote, have worn off. And they're now in their own head, seeing things as they see it normally. I turn around and go to my apartment. Still got me, even though I've seen this before. Did you bring milk? Hi, Mum. Did you bring milk? 
Now, I'm just going to pause here because this is like very near the end. I just want to, before I give a final conclusion, I just want to say I love the design of this because I feel like it, his, his far, uh, their father didn't really kill himself. I feel like she, the mother, may have murdered him for what seems to be not bringing milk. Because the character mentioned in a different dialogue that I forgot to go through, Mum will throw me out the window if I don't buy milk. I didn't go that route because that wasn't the one that I wanted to show you that ended the game. And uh, what I love about the design is it shows no major features. There's no hair colour. There's no real eyes. The nose is barely visible. And same with the mouth. In just a slight, creepy, unsettling smile. Did you bring milk? Yes, ma'am. Did your new medicine help? Yes, ma'am. Go to bed. Yes, ma'am. That's how the game ends. <laughs> Oh, it's still unsettling even playing it through a second time. Uh, right, so there's a reason that the video just didn't end there and I wasn't saying my goodbyes there. So I just wanted to take a quick note if and say again, if anything is going wrong, you're having any problems, you're feeling down with no explanation, you're feeling ill with no explanation, you're feeling drained with no explanation, or you're just not in the right headspace reach out to someone find someone that can help reach out to your friends family carers guardians teachers whoever you can you you do matter everyone in this world matters you're not an exception because you're having a bad day and um even if you feel like you can't go anywhere, there will be somewhere you can go. There are people you can find, people you can ring, friends you can talk to. Just make sure you hang on. Because tough times don't last. Uh, they always seem like they will last forever. But the longer you try through the tough time, the, uh, the stronger you'll be for the next one. And I just want to leave you guys with that parting message that you guys do matter and you can make a difference. Latch on to your dreams and don't let go. You can make it and you can become who you want to be. This was a psychological horror by a very weird name. <laughs> and uh, I've been Minnie and thank you for watching. If you do want to see more like this, let me know. Uh, leave a like or comment on other games like this. And uh, if you really want to keep up with me, you can subscri consider subscribing too. Uh, thank you and have a good day.